Hi, this is Chris from GrowQuest, and I've had a lot of calls from customers who have had avocado trees dropping a lot of foliage. A few of these uh, calls are the result of people not watering properly their larger trees after planting or delivery, which as the temperatures warm up is crucial. However, I realized driving back and forth to my place and seeing all the avocado trees on a regular basis that this also happens quite a bit in very, very well maintained groves. Some avocado trees, well actually we'll go more specific, Haas avocado trees will retain all of their foliage or most of their foliage and just drop some of the uh, leaves as a normal part of life cycle. And here's a Haas on my left. Lots of foliage, it's breaking out in bloom, fruit's been recently picked. Should preface that it's the middle of April. Here's another Haas. It's dropping a lot of foliage. Um, part of that is that the foliage has been well, well attacked by persamite, which is all those uh, spots on there. So it's going to drop that persamite infected foliage just as a natural course of development and during the bloom cycle. Here it is flushing out new foliage and blooms. But the thing is that Haas, and I would need a lot more information, that Haas, when it goes into bloom, often sheds most or all of its foliage. And I'm sorry I've never mentioned this before. It's just uh, everything that's always going on. I got a million things I can thinking of and questions people are always asking me and I never thought to take a moment to explain that some haws are just like people. I mean there there just seems to be a different behavior among every hundred trees or so. Again, left side perfectly green. Lots of foliage, although it's not really in bloom yet. There's some blooms coming in. Fully in bloom, Haas? Hardly a leaf on the damn tree. It's starting to flush new foliage, and as it finishes the bloom cycle, it will flush a lot more, and we'll come back to this tree in about eight to 10 weeks, where I'll be completely covered in foliage. These trees are on drip irrigation. You can see they're on raised beds. This is a commercially maintained grove. And if you want to see what the results of that is, look at all the damn fruit on the tree. Here's a tree that's gone from uh, bloom and it's re-leafing re back out. Remember, Haas has to deal sometimes with persamite, so those leaves will fall off, but it's finishing up bloom and it's rebutting out and you can see the monster amount of fruit that's on this tree. I mean, these, well over 200 avocados on here if not more. Again further down this row trees that are completely in bloom and have great foliage uh, cover. Go back over here naked as a jaybird. Yeah and, and you can see the foliage that's up top is all drooping down and basically is getting ready to, to fall off. My place is across the way over here guys are loading up a gajillion palm trees over there and got my avocados and citrus on the far end of the field need to get some goats in here but I said I was walking over here the other day and it just like oh yeah maybe I should use the other side of the ranch here to uh, to highlight this fact so I think the most important thing concluding this up is if the tree's in bloom and losing its foliage and the blooms are opening up and the fruit is developing on the, the tips of the blooms, don't stress. If the tree does not in bloom and it's dropping its fruit and it's dropping its leaves, well then you're too dry. Otherwise we're just in the midst of normal Haas behavior. 
I'm not ever taking the time to note how this behavior goes over to Surprise, Lamb Haws, the other Haws varieties, but at least with straight regular Haws, like here's a great example. There's hardly a damn leaf on the branch. Flowers are upright. They're not dropping off, so you know the water is good. It just, for whatever reason, is not leafed out. Clearly the opposite over here. Yeah, actually two trees the same behavior. One right on the left and one on the one on the one on the left and one on the right. Blooming and dropping leaves. Starting to bloom and has all its leaves. So and again these are commercial trees, you don't find anybody out here pruning the heck out of them. I mean it would be a good idea, but I mean you can only spend so much in them damn avocado tree in a farm area you got several thousand trees but that's a different issue all right so email me any of your own pictures and let's take a look at them